hi hello welcome to my channel and today my topic is in the power system one that is per unit system per unit system is very important in the power system and you will get at least three marks in any exam regarding this per unit system so i wanna discuss the topics of per unit system what is the per unit system in per unit system we don't mention any units no units will be mentioned in per unit system because in actual system we have a units but in the per unit system we don't have a units in per unit system i am telling you example percentage of impedance is will be given like 20% let's let's take an example percentage of impedance is 20 percent so what we have to do is 0.2 per unit if voltage is one per unit this is the per unit system generally we consider the systems like x is equal to some two ohms but in the per unit system we will like percentage of x let's take a random examples of 30 percent so 0.3 is the per unit value so most important and most easiest bit in the per unit system that is in transformer we have two resistances like two reactances that is primary this is the secondary so primary secondary so in actual system i'm writing in actual system the primary resist uh, reactance and the secondary reactance not equal but in in per unit system the primary and secondary reactances is equal this is the important bit in transformer per unit impedance of primary and secondary are equal next how to find out a z impedance with the new base values so i am writing the formula very very important formula for finding the impedance per unit impedance to get a per unit impedance we should have actual impedance value then actual sorry base impedance value so I am telling the formula for base impedance this is only for base impedance not for base current not for base voltage not for base MEA I am telling only for Z base impedance base why I am stressing is you will get a base in base current and base MEA also so this formula will be used for base this one only i am giving now so that is v base square by if you take this in kilo volts then it should be the mva i am proving with the formula that z base is some resistance so what we took 1 volt into 1 volt by mva mva is volt into ampere 1 volt 1 volt camper volt by ampere is resistance only that is impedance only see got it v into v by v into v by v into a so v we cancel so you got resistance this is z base so the overall formula for z 
per unit is z actual into k v square by m v n right so z base and that here don't confuse k v square by m v this is the z base impedance base so z actual into m v a by k v whole square this is the per unit impedance just make a note this is the per unit impedance z actual by z base z base is k v square by m v a k v square by m v a let us solve one example based on this problem see the example as per i explained x per unit is equal to x actual that is z actual by z base I'm taking z base or x base so what is the formula x actual into m v a by k v whole square so i have x actual that is 2 and 2 m v a 100 m v a by k v square that's good so 2 into 100 by 10 square 100 so 100 100 gets cancelled 2 is the answer 